destruction. I am the greatest wrestler on the planet. You hear me? I carried this company as a man who was never even supposed to be a contender. I've said it a million times because it's a million times true. Because I have the best underdog story. But because I am the best. He was one of the most dominant GCW champions of all time. But the matter of fact is, he got humbled. You're afraid, Will. Ever since WrestleMania last year, you haven't been able to keep my name out your mouth. Scared at WS, he's taking over. No, no, no! CCW! Wait! No! I will never bow to the likes of you! You can talk, talk, talk about how hard you work to get to the top of this mountain and gaslight everyone in this audience into thinking you deserve all your fame and power, but I don't buy easy, bitch. You have made a joke, a mockery, out of the crap I dedicated my f***ing life to! You're afraid, Will. You're afraid that you're going to fall back down the ladder, back down to the cruiserweight division, back to irrelevance. You're taking it out on me. The one man you blame for this domino effect. You see, I know your biggest fear, your biggest insecurity. The truth you can't seem to bear, Will, is that the company that you represent is just a low-rent WSC ripoff that's been at it 11 years and they still can't hack it. Everything was going absolutely perfectly for me until the stage creator. It kind of feels like it was meant to be. And that is why I'm challenging you to a match at Extreme Rules. You're coming after everything I stand for. Well, I'm here to tell you I'm damn proud of everything I've done. WSC needs to be stopped. I've been me since day one, through and through. Never needed to be anything else. At Extreme Rules, I accept your challenge. No technical wrestling is going to save you from this beatdown that's coming your way. I'm even willing to do this your one. Hardcore match. I'm a trendsetter, a visionary of the game. I chase the dream. I put my heart, my soul into everything I do. And these people, no matter gender, race, age, they believe in me. They believe in WSC. I will restore the dignity in professional wrestling by destroying you. This is my life. I didn't ask for this fight, but I'm sure as hell going to finish it. For the sake of my love, for this business, this beautiful craft that you've disfigured, I will drop you on your head, and for all these people, I will shut you up. I, Will Spike, will stand against you, for all of them, the real fans. I'm gonna fuck you up, bro. Well, it's about that time to witness the changing of tides. One way or the other, this is arguably the most anticipated match of this pay-per-view! Osprey has laid out the gauntlet for his next opponent here, a trendsetter by the name of Nathan, the stage creator. And he's willing to go to war to protect all that he believes in. Yeah, Osprey, just look at the look in his eyes. He is serious, he's ready to go for this matchup that he wanted for a long time. Yeah, some people say that this vendetta against WSC started at Elimination Chamber when he was named the special guest referee in the GCW versus FAW Elimination Chamber match. I think this started all the way back at WrestleMania 10, and here's why. Osprey defeated Kota Ibushi to win his iconic GCW Championship reign. But ever since then, the one thing people have been talking about is whatever stage creator's been doing. He was in the semi-main event of that show, and that match was considered an afterthought. Yeah, that's something that can definitely nag on you, but all the attention was on Osprey and Stage Creator on GCW Live in December after this promo battle. 
Yeah, that promo was something else. It set the entire internet on fire. Things got real, and if you ask me, I think Will Ospreay was successful on turning the GCW crowd against the stage creator. Just listen to this place. And he kind of seems caught off guard by this as well as I kind of am as well. This is, this is interesting. Now that is amazing. This man, Will Ospreay, went from being the main villain of GCW to its now unsung hero against the tyranny of the stage creator. Osprey's mindset, not mine, of course. And you can hear a split reaction for both men. The GCW hardcores behind Osprey, the casuals behind the stage creator. Yeah, me personally, Nathan's my boy. He's our boy, he's our friend. But right now, judging from the crowd's reaction tonight, I'm not sure who is the favorite to win this Extreme Rules match. Which is very interesting, because Will Osprey looks down on the very concept of Extreme Rules matches, but now he's willing to step into the stage creator's backyard to beat him at his own game amplifying the embarrassment further. Yeah, I think that's exactly why he wanted it to be a hardcore match. That is what Stage Creator is of course famous for and beating him in that would be huge for Osprey. Some people could consider this the true main event of Extreme well, Rules. This going, ring the bell. And I can't lie, I say that this oh. match doesn't have big fight feel attached to it. Yeah, and you can see Osprey charging right up the gate and a hook kick. Now going for Oscutter. Oh, Oscutter early on, but oh, backstabber by the stage creator. Osprey is going to be feeling that for the rest of the match with all the bangers that he's put out time after time oh, here oh, at CCW. Careful. It might just be over with the creation of destruction. Oh. Spike Spikes that on his head. Oh, oh. Oscutter. My God. And that's all she wrote. Just like that, it's over! But Nathan Good kicks out! Two. My god, that was close. Could you imagine if that was all it took to take down the king of this community, the stage creator? Yeah, and now Osprey got him on the outside. What is he thinking? Wait a minute, Osprey looking for Sky Twister! Wait, I think I see something. I think I see something with Stage Crater there. Oh yeah, Osprey oh yeah. From the top of the oh! oh my god, chair! He just fell face first onto some steel with that chair that Stage Creator pulled out of the ring. He's making Will Osprey pay some more! Now Osprey is feeling the element of hardcore on his back. Just straight pulverizing the body of the former GCW world champ. See an instant replay here. Oh, this was just nasty. Oh, yeah. That was bad. Right in the stomach. And now Stage Crater sending the head of Osprey into the ring apron. And you gotta think, this is pretty euphoric for uh, Stage Creator. All the trash that Osprey has been talking for months upon months upon months. And now he's getting his just desserts. Oh, oh sunset flip onto the setup chair. That is not gonna bode well for our former champ. Yeah, and it has been over a year, if you remember, Extreme Rules Media Scrum is pretty much where it all started last year, or, or there, Osprey. Oh my God, straight back. Well, Osprey just going ham on the stage creator, but once again, these two just going tip for tat here. Oh, oh! oh. With that DDT! Just spiking the head! of the aerial assassin onto the ground right in front of you, Luke. Yeah, these two just counter each other oh, non-stop. That Come was on. a nice DDT. It's now Stage Creator. And now Stage Creator has one of the guardrails. What's he thinking of doing here? Osprey is out of his element. That's for damn sure. He can do all the flips he wants, but at the end of the day, this is still an Extreme Rules match. Yeah, and Stage Creator got that thing set up, and I think he's planning to lay out Osprey on top of that steel barricade. This is a very interesting dynamic here because in another Extreme Rules pay-per-view, 
Osprey had G-Man in a similar predicament, but what the hell is this? What? Look at the quickness of Osprey! Oh my god! Spanish fly through the guardrail! Bricks across this one and the apron! This reminds me of the Royal Rumble last year when Osprey took advantage of that glass pane that was introduced by Nick Gage in the Bloodline versus United Empire match. And here he does it with. And here I thought Osprey didn't know how to utilize his surroundings in an Extreme Rules match! Yeah, here he does it with the guardrail. Now Earl Hebner trying to check on WSC, but Osprey's not going to give him the time of day. He's trying to use that piece of the guardrail to his advantage. Oh, oh my god! Huge quick. kick to the forehead. A stage creator trying to look for a German suplex, rather. And to the ring post! Oh, that could be bad. That could be bad. Oh boy, this is gonna be bad. Oh, 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 he got on his feet! Oh, oh, oh my first god! Onto to the post! That Osprey head first hard into the post. He's been quick on his feet. Osprey down. God, it was just a vicious collision yeah. with his forehead onto the steel post. The speed he went into that post whip was insane. Oh, and now you can see yeah. the effects of this match taking its toll on the body of the former GCW champion. And stage creator has yet another oh, toy. I love, oh, wait love. a minute, Osprey from the top drop. Oh, take my oh my God. And Osprey stuck that shooting star press onto the trash can. And the sternum of the stage creator. This is what it's going to take if you want to beat the stage creator in his element. Nicely done by Osprey. Yeah, that's right. Osprey is as tenacious as they come. He will not rest until he puts the reign of WSC over his community, so his company, to, to rest. That was a drop kick or a lung blower, but in any case, it was effective against the former champ. Power bomb straight on his neck, rolls him up. Oh, what a kick to the face! But Osprey fires back with a discus elbow, hook kick, along with a roundhouse from WSC, and they both go down. What a stalemate this match has come to. Yeah, Osprey still rocked from. Getting into the post, I believe. Oh, what a backhanded this! And once again, oh. trying to channel his Cobra Kai training. But that oh, oh, oh. Oh, opens the door for the hidden plate. But Stage Creator in with a counter. Sets him up on the top. Yeah, it was very important that Stage Creator avoided that hidden blade right there. Oh, the disrespect still defiantly present. But oh, oh my God, he just smacked the taste out of his lips. Yeah, now Stage Creator. He's heading to the top as well. Oh, he's looking to make him pay. Oh my goodness oh. gracious! But I will hit and blade! Hit and blade! It's over! Oh, oh he kicked out! You got it too! Osprey channeled too. all his rage, his frustration, his disdain for WSC to no sell that avalanche backbreaker and took the advantage to hit. A hidden blade straight flesh on the mouth of the stage creator. Yeah, he had to take that opportunity, but you can see it definitely hurt his back as he's trying to recover and stage creator as well. And I think Osprey has had enough of this charade. One more hidden blade to put the final nail in the coffin of WSC. Oh! Take the ducks! Springboard! Into the oh. sling blade, beautifully done by Nathan. That was as beautiful as they come in an important counter not to get that next hidden blade. That would probably have been it. And now the stage creator. Oh my god, just the disrespect on oh, full display as Nathan makes sure every chair he introduces hits the goal. Former champion, but he bounces right back with that haluba kick. Yeah, that wasn't a good idea. And I think he's got an idea to use the instruments of destruction against its creator. Oh! Oh, oh! Creation of destruction! Oh, that would have been Oh, my God! Oh, 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 oh
fucking Lord fucking have fuck. mercy! Did you hear the fucking fuck. sickening crack? Huh? The snap of the this. skull! This is your king! He put of everything he had into it. As Osprey just bent that chair over his head! Talk back to me. Will, Will, come on. That's enough. I you had this in the back, That's bro. enough, Will. Did I beat now you? Osprey looming over game. the lifeless body of the stage creator. Oh, and oh my god! Oh my god! Oh, my god. He's just targeting the oh, back and the head oh, of the stage creator! Oh, this is too much! Oh, Even for an extreme rules match! Yeah. Oh my god. He wanted this! Yeah, you're right. At the end of the day. WSC signed up for this. this. He wanted this to shut Osprey up by any means this necessary, but right now, Osprey is in the Come damn on. zone. Come on. Come on. But, but look, he has not moved since that chair shot. Now he is a little. But I'm starting to think this match needs to be stopped. Yeah, this doesn't this doesn't look good. Oh my god! That's it. That's it. Just end it now, Will. He's gone! You've proven your point! Yeah. Oh my god. Osprey's just toying with him. He's enjoying his time here in that ring against this little punk and stage creator. And once again, his mindset, not mine. Looking for the Stormbreaker, but wait! Wait a minute, Nathan! Oh my god! Plants him on the top of his skull with that sit-out pile driver! Almost a creation of destruction, not quite with the elevation, but it was important. The blood of both of these men staining the battlefield as neither of them are going to give up until they see the other one dead and buried. But it looks like Stage Creator oh. has a head start in that matter. Onto Looking the for the chair. creation of destruction, but once again, Osprey able to escape with the combos and planning. Oh, oh no! Oh. Once again into the pile driver! Osprey's on dead legs! Oh yeah, this could be it. What is he thinking? Whoa. Oh my god! Osprey able to counter with that cutter! And he just clobbers the back of the oh, head yeah. of Stage Creator! But at what cost? This man can't even stand! Yeah, he got dropped twice in the period of a few seconds on his neck. This can't be good. Like many times, I absolutely agree with the crowd here in this sold-out stadium. But what, what is stage creator thinking? Off the ropes, into the dive. Oh, oh, no! Oh, my God! Suicide dive into the blockbuster. Damn near snapped the spine and the neck of Osprey over that guardrail. Oh, my oh God. No. Now, now, now it's Osprey who can't even respond. Yeah. I mean, stage creator is preparing the neck for the creation of destruction, but he might have already crushed it. Can you feel your hands, Will? Now the turntables. Earl Hebner trying to make sure Osprey is all right to continue this match. Screw the match to continue his career. Stay back now. Stay back. And stage creator is chomping at the bit to lay out more punishment. Stay back, then. I gotta. I gotta get. Some doctors There's TJP. Oh, yeah, right. supporting Osprey out here. Out here to check on him. But, but on, Earl wants him doctors. On, you gotta get up before the doctors come down. Oh, oh, oh wait a minute! Come on. The stage hey, creator on. taking Slow flight. Down. Stage creator not wanting to risk a stoppage. Opening the door to the end of this match. Come on, it's too Could this be it's too much. the end? Of Will Ospreay as we know it! He wants to finish it! to the stage creator, but wait! Oh, oh. Wait a Power bomb! My god dropped him on his neck, but he's still in the match! That might have been Will Ospreay's last chance at victory! Look at him! Yeah. Oh man, this doesn't look good. He is so spent, so damaged from all of his years, putting out classic after classic. Now it's all oh. coming back to bite him! Straight that on the neck, neck again. breaker onto the chair! Nathan signaling that it's all yeah. over! Creation of destruction! Surely this time it'll land! That yeah, is going to be it. Up and out of the way! Wait! Osprey! Osprey! Suplex oh. stutter! That's G-Man's move! Hit it! Oh right my off God. The chin. He got him! He got him! He got him! What? No way! He kicked out two 
Nathan still two kicks turn out! Two turn only. Osprey used the finisher of his arch nemesis here in GCW. A man that he says Nathan screwed over himself. At WrestleMania, he said that Nathan's philosophy of views over substance was the reason for Roman Reigns screwing G-Man over that night. With GCW management oh doing absolutely God. nothing. Did you see that? Will Ospreay yes, has lost it. He's wrapping the barbed wire around his arm. You know what he's thinking. He's thinking of a deadly hidden blade. Yeah, if that hits, that could be it for good here. My God, no! Able to duck! Wait a minute! The stage creator has Osprey in his clutches! Osprey trying to escape! Trying to reach for the rope, but oh. no avail! But he also made use of that barbed wire wrapped around the arm of Osprey, scraping it across the face before he hit that backbreaker, neckbreaker, and Osprey getting rid of that barbed wire. Yeah, that backfired. The plan backfired, no doubt. I think Osprey is on his last letter in his repertoire of plans to take out the stage creator. Yeah, this Nathan has been matching Osprey blow for blow. Wait a minute. What did TJP say? Oh, look, around his knee. Oh, my God, barbed wire knee. He wrapped the barbed wire on his knee. He set out destruction. Osprey kicks out. What? He kicked out and turned. Take any chances with the former GCW champion. A wise move as he lays out the creation of destruction again to beat Osprey. My God. There is no doubt in my mind that Will Osprey took everything in stride to try his damnedest to dethrone the king of this community, the stage creator. But at the end of the day, stage creator defeated Osprey with experience. There's no other way to put it. Osprey was out of his element. You can't really blame him. And honestly, right now, I think I have a newfound respect for the former bane of GCW and Will Osprey. And so has this crowd. But there's still much more to come here in Extreme Rules. Well, goddamn. If it ain't the kid that's run the main event scene these days. Hey, Steve. I'm actually here to talk to the old man. Well, here I am. You ready for another big main event tonight? What Osprey said out there. Was it true? Uh, what are you talking about? That you let Roman cash in Solo's briefcase because you don't believe in me. Oh, well, gee, man, that's, that's ridiculous. I mean, we were caught off guard, too. We had to make a decision in a, in a split second. I mean, in the end, it got people talking. And now you're here, tonight, in another main event, getting your rematch. If I didn't believe in you, do you think that I would have you Main event, here again, tonight. Hmm. You know what? I think you're right. At this point, it doesn't really matter. Tonight's gonna be judgment day for the bloodline. It's gonna be hard to get screwed out of an I Quit match, right? I just hope that all your contracts are airtight, and that you won't be held responsible for what will happen in your ring tonight. Well, that sounds, uh, uh G-Man. Hey! Hey, G-Man! 